morning and welcome to the TI booth at Electronica 2016. Um, here we have one of our eye catcher demos which is based on uh, so ro some robotic technology which we can explain to you today. So here we have what is called a, a lightweight, compact and connected type of robot and it's called, it's called Franker, so meet, please meet Franker. You can see a lot of press on uh, YouTube etc about Franker and a lot of information. And the reason why it's here today is that we have uh, Texas Instruments and Franker and Mika, the creators of Franker, have a collaborative and technology partnership on some of the components and some of the application designs within the robot itself. So what Franker is doing today, and you see on YouTube that Franker actually can build itself, today it's actually presenting itself. So we have on display here a lot of the TI devices that you would see in this type of application space inside a robot, around a robot, and also monitoring the robot. And Franker is, is actually presenting itself with a slide set uh, going through the different products that are coming from TI, and we have them on display here as well. And in addition, on the, on the left-hand side, we have the TI reference designs associated with each of those products. So the reference designs are the way that we can actually build solutions that help customers with subsystems to very quickly engage with our, with our products and to very quickly get into design. So we talk about what Franker is actually doing. He's actually being, or he or she, is actually being controlled by a PowerPoint presentation. So we send commands to the robot through the, through the controller to enable it to then trigger certain operations that are trained by the robot. So he knows what slide, what index within the slide that he's working with and accordingly he will then go and touch the slide, uh, change the slides, touch the buttons and switch the light sequences on that we have the highlighting some of our EVMs as well as gesturing on the slides according to what product features we want to highlight. So in fact it's, it's, it's almost controlled by PowerPoint itself and what's unique about Franker is the way that we actually train the sequences and the trajectories of how the robot actually moves. So it's, it's more like a macro type of uh, uh, combination where you actually hand hold the robot and take it through the trajectories to, from one coordinate to another coordinate and, and then you record it and play it back which is what we're doing here. The other um, feature of Franker is the safety aspect. So this, project, this, this robot has been designed with in mind the interaction with humans. So the ability to actually touch the robot, interact, move the robot without fear of actually you know, human injury and physical injury. So if we talk about, uh, briefly about the products that we've got on display here, we've got Captivate in the front here. So, Captivate is a cap touch and proximity sensing technology from TI based on MSP430, which could be used on the robot or the robot can actually use itself. So here we have a, capti a capaci capacitive touch, touch screen, which of course the robot is using to, to flick through the slides. We have three forms of uh, motor drive technology here. We have the encoders, position encoders for absolute angle type feedback. We've got the, the, the drive component itself, so where we're driving the voltage and the current to the motors, so actually interfacing to the motors, that's our DRV products. And we've also got the MCUs and the processes behind that with the software libraries to basically take any customer motor and within uh, minutes be able to spin that motor accordingly and also without necessarily having sensor feedback to, to control the motor. We also have our Hercules product on the safety aspects. So this is um, a product that we have with uh, certain safety, safety I packages behind it, design packages, to allow a customer to very quickly get to the correct safety level around our devices, which of course in each of these types of applications, all, all applications like this have a specific safety level according, according to their failure rate. And finally, we have our connectivity products, so our ultra-low power SOCs. So we have Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and sub-1 gigahertz. And this is a connected robot, so this is a robot that can communicate at the, simultaneously with other robots. So the actions you see here could be projected to a robot in another country, and it can be doing exactly the same thing. And 
For the connectivity part of it, that's normally over Ethernet or real-time Ethernet. For the wireless connectivity part of it, then we have sensor information that could go into the robot or control what the robot actually does. Okay, so thank you for listening to us uh, on our TI booth here, our eye catcher demo at Electronica 2016. For more information, please go to ti.com. Thank you.